Today we've got a special guest. He's my teammate, Kyle Rizam. He's one of the fastest players in the league. And he's going to give you information about football development in Malaysia, how it works, and also really important information for you guys. He's seen many import players come to Kalantan and play. So he's going to tell you what you need to do to stand out as an import player. Rizam, hey, how are you, bro? You good? Come, 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 come. Oh, Guys, Cairo Rizam, nickname Cristiano Ronaldo. <laughs> Very good player. Let's go interview him. Now normally in Malaysia, when you're growing up, you go to a sports school if you want to play professional football later. And he didn't actually go to a sports school, he went to a normal school. So for him to be selected was actually a really big accomplishment. And he didn't have any football education, you learnt off your phone, yeah. watching Ronaldo. He loves Ronaldo, he plays a bit like him, he's fast, he's got a lot of tricks. And he learnt also playing in the villages. And I'll let him tell you his story of how he became a professional footballer in Malaysia. Normally, untuk menjadi seorang pemain bola sepak profesional di Malaysia ini, uh, awak haruslah pergi ataupun bermain untuk sekolah sukan, uh, like uh, sports school, like that, and training every day at sports school. Me have a different story because I'm not from the sports school. I'm from the village and I start from village to become a professional football player in Malaysia. Semasa saya uh, sekolah, berada sekolah, saya tidak pernah terpilih untuk mewakili uh, negeri saya iaitu Kelantan. Saya hanya bermain untuk uh, kampung, untuk sekolah, for school and dengan kawan-kawan. So, first try I'm go at the Kelantan under 19. Tetapi, bila saya pergi selection, saya melihat ada 400 atau 500 orang datang. Many player, you know, hmm. come around Kelantan, come at one place. And, I don't get selected. After, selepas itu, saya more work hard, more do extra, more look video Cristiano. Yeah. <laughs> and, <laughs> see! And, and I go select again. But I tell myself, if I don't get selected this time, I don't want to play football. Quit? You want to quit? Yeah, I want to quit football. I don't think about football. But I go and I'm proud to God and I have been selected. From 400 people? Yeah, from 400 or 500 people. How long was the trial? The trial take time only like uh, 3 weeks or 4 weeks. Four weeks, yeah. wow. So they just cut down players every yeah, time. Just cut down player like every friendly he cut three player, four player, you understand? Wow. Yeah. Until how many how many remained? Until squad like 30, 25 wow. and finish. Uh Saya mula menatangi ni contract sebagai seorang pemain bola sepak profesional ni pada umur 19. Uh, last two year I play for Kelantan. One year in Super League, dan sekarang Premier League. If you as a, as a striker, if you play good, only play good, but you did not score a goal, uh, fans we don't like you, and management we don't like you, maybe kick out you, understand? If you play not good, but you score a goal, always score a goal, every game you score a goal. Fans will like you and management will like you. All players will like you. <laughs> it's normal, right? Yeah, yeah true. It's going to go. Clean sheet, you know? Clean sheet, must clean sheet. He must control all, like fullback and partner defender. He must control all and he must hide. He must strong. He can challenge high ball. He cool. Uh, it's perfect. And it's more good if he can talk with another player. Talk, you must, hey, hey, come back, come back. Hey, so stay. leadership. Ah, leadership. Normal day, saya biasanya, kalau saya bangun pagi tu, 
Saya rasa okey, tak rasa penat, tak rasa sakit mana-mana. Uh, rasa okey saya pergi jogging around 30 minit jogging and juggling the ball like say in the morning one hour by yourself. And after that I uh, just relax, uh, play FIFA at my studio and just play and sometimes you can learn from this from FIFA. You can learn the position, right position, how to play, you can learn. Yeah. And just waiting relax and waiting uh, my second training with the head coach on like that. So yeah guys, just on that Carl Rizam, he's got a FIFA cafe, he's got six different consoles, so if you want to play FIFA with a lot of the players, he's got his own shop where you can come down and play. Yeah, if you win with me, you play for free. <laughs> I'll leave all his details about his shop on, the, on this YouTube page. If you're in Kalantan, go check him out. Zufami, uh, Shaifu Alias. Already beaten. <laughs> no good? No good for you. No good. And Demi Ali. Oh, oh Demi and Lim very... Demi and Lim only talk, huh? Only talk. Okay, cool. So go check that out. Alright guys, I want to thank Kyle Rizam for coming in today and telling his story and how football in Malaysia works. He provides some really good information. If you're an import player, you want to stand out, you're a striker, you need to score goals. Like I said before, yeah. if you play bad, but don't score, People don't like you. If you make assists, people don't like you. You need to score goals. <laughs> Same with defending, you keep a clean sheet, you're strong, you command everyone. You'll do very good in Malaysia, in Asia. So yeah, Kyle, thank you. Yeah. And we've got training soon, so we'll see you guys soon again. And if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe if you're new. And until next time, ciao. See you again.